banana. What do you want on it, baby? Maria, you want pancakes? Tori Chase. Tori Chase. <laughs> Come eat some pancakes. No, she doesn't want any. She had a waffle. <laughs> Dax, here's her. Here, hi, bud. Banana on your eye. <laughs> I'm just guessing in my head. What is that metal thing? <laughs> ready to go to the pool? Put the hat. Are you ready? Here's the way yours or mine. And it's black. All right, it's the next day, and we're gonna go to the pool. You see, it's probably gonna take a nap there, hopefully. Yes. I hope he does. Let's go to the pool, pool, let's go to the pool. This is one of my new swimsuits from um, Cupshe. It's really cute. It's kind of like a little boobalicious, but it's really cute and um, easy to nurse in, obviously. So we've been bringing our little, um, what is this called? A wagon. And then putting Easton in his uh, stroller, which we have to set up. But then I have a little jumper in here. We have puddle jumpers for the kids. Well, Jack just needs one. Towels, water guns. I just need my water. We're home from the pool and Easton's eating some apple, pumpkin, and granola. Um, pizza. Oh, it smells really good. I bet you that this sauce on that, on like a cheese pizza would almost be similar to that Barabbas pizza. We're having leftovers, cleaning up the fridge before we have family in town, my dad. And um, John's eating a burger. John. This is John. What else did your name be? Babe. Jake from State Farm. So awkward. <laughs> Your you taste a little salty. <gasps> Goodbye. Who that? Who that baby? It's you. It's you. This is the pizza spot. Oh, you didn't show me the actual. This is the whole pizza. It looks so good. Wish I could have some. I feel like I'm doing the worst job ever vlogging because I honestly haven't vlogged in quite some time. I'm gonna switch Easton into these um, because I just fed him and he's got blueberries all over him. But last you saw me, we were making some lunch and then we all took showers. Easton was so fussy and so cranky. He really has been honestly for the past like couple weeks. He has a cold right now, or he did, and so he's feeling better though. Um, and he's teething, and I think we're going through something. Um, I, my God, I'm blowing my hair. I personally haven't been sleeping very well because Easton hasn't been sleeping very well. He's only been sleeping well in my arms. So to be honest, I haven't put him down in well over 24 hours. I mean, I put him down like for here and there, but like as far as like sleeping, napping, he hasn't napped on his own in probably a week um and nighttime has been really hard 
so um we need to get back into that but he's going through something and it's just been really hard he's been very like this so if you feel like you're struggling i get it stop pulling my hair um and so anyway it's been hard for me to pick up the camera because it's been like this plus he took a nap for quite some time we just went and go got a little, little, little we just went and picked up chick-fil-a so we had that for dinner um but i don't really know what we're gonna do for the rest of the evening maybe play like a family game um i'm gonna change him into these other pajamas and then let him play for a minute because he or for a little bit actually because he actually napped in the car when we went to get chick-fil-a so he took kind of a late later little cat nap but um anyway He's getting fuss. Mm. I'm gonna show you guys like what I've been feeding him. Um, I mean, it's mostly purees still, but the doctor did say that I need to up his calories because they said that he's like on the smaller end. He's five in the fifth percentile for his age. Are you gonna play with this? So it doesn't mean a lot to me because like I know my kids and they're pretty petite. I'm pretty petite um, and he's breastfed and I feel like breastfed babies are kind of skinnier I don't know or like less body fat I don't know um so anyway anywho I'm gonna change him and figure out what we're gonna do mm -hmm. let's change out of these white jammies were not a good choice for dinner time they were not been hardcore cleaning all day it's the next day um and i'm just putting away all of easton's clothes he's over here he just woke up from his nap not too long ago so we've been cleaning because um my dad's actually coming in town and we, we're gonna have family over and stuff like that so we figured we'd do some deep cleaning today um i'm actually gonna bring some clothes to i didn't know, I thought he would fill so um target because they're having a sale and they're doing a lot of cat and jack and i have a lot of cat and jack stuff i went through oh gosh careful 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 what are you doing you i went through the kids clothes and they had a bunch of cat and jack clothes and if you're not familiar they take um their old cat and jack if it's been within a year to and they like recycle it or whatever but they give you money for it so i'm gonna bring those clothes so I can do that because the kids are going to need clothes for school. Anyway. It's a big boy. It's a big boy. Look at you crawling. Yay. 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 Look at you. Oh. I know. You see the camera? You're going to crawl to the camera? I know you're doing so good crawling. Good job. Keep going. Come on. <laughs> Careful. Keep going. That's a good crawling. Come on. Wow. Can you guys believe it that he's crawling? He's also standing up. Pulling himself up and standing, which is so crazy. He's obsessed with this fan. You're not allowed to play with that. It's dangerous. It's not on, don't worry. But. Why do kids always want to play with dangerous things? I think I did this in my last vlog. We just got ready. And I'm going to bring... Um, clothes to cat and jack or target the cat and jack clothes um and see if i can get some money for school clothes and just for summer clothes so that's what we're gonna go do take a little break from like our cleaning um and just like get out of the house also the kids earned some coupons for their behavior i don't know if i'll show you, showed you guys but let me show you real quick before i run out the door um they have this reward chart and they've been doing so good and it's been so nice for the summer having like structure and giving them you know Thing, tasks to do and they love little stars i'll link this thing down below it's really nice it comes with a lot of um 
thing because it's perfect. So anyway, they earned some rewards, so they want to go to Five Below, and then we're gonna go to Target and just get out of the house for a minute. Hey guys, hope you're doing well. Um, there's a car pulling up next to me, so this might get awkward. But anyway, um, I got went and got my nails done, and um, so I left the house real quick to go get my nails done. And this is what I ended up getting. I went with like a green color, and I think I'm gonna stop doing that because every time I go with this green, like a, a similar green color, it either looks like glow in the dark or it looks like boogers, or it just like doesn't look good. Um, I had my, you probably didn't so, I had my headphones in because uh, I was just having a mommy moment because I've been nonstop with the baby. But um, anyway, so I was listening to a podcast, but ugh, those headphones always hurt my ears. Um, anyway, the nails. So I ended up asking her after I saw it, I was like, can we add some chrome? Cause she, she had chrome on her nails. And I was like, that's really pretty. I know it's a little bit extra, but, uh, I was like, I need something to spice this up because I'm not going to like it if I, um, if I don't do something about it. So I I asked her to do some chrome. So we got some silver chrome on them, Haley Bieber style, if you will. Um, I like them way better than I did before. So my husband asked me coffee, question mark, question mark. I don't know if he wants me to get him coffee or he wants me to get a coffee. I was feeling super anxious in there, honestly, because I was drinking. I had only had coffee today. So I'm gonna ask him again. Um, so we'll see what he says, but we're gonna head home. My dad comes into town today. Um, if you want one, do you? Um, so my dad comes into town today. It's the 4th of July tomorrow. I'm gonna go grab him a Starbs. Probably gonna listen to the rest of my podcast, honestly, because I'm just having a me moment. And I feel like Easton was very full when I left and I'm just feel good about leaving him today he I gave told my husband to give him a banana if he seemed hungry he's telling me to get coffee so making me think that everything's peachy keen it's really been hard for me to leave Easton recently because he's been so 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 clingy and so fussy I think the nine months is like god it's like struggle city but um I feel really good about leaving today and it only took me an hour to get my nails done I'm feeling good. So anyway, I'm trying out a new nail place too. This is my second time there and so far it's it's all right. Um, but I'm gonna grab us some coffee. I know this vlog was literally all over the place and I feel like I've been having such a struggle with YouTube to be honest um, because I've been putting all of my effort on Instagram. So if you aren't following me on Instagram, it would mean the absolute world to me if you would follow me on Instagram because I put my heart and soul into that Instagram and Instagram Reels has really, I mean, it's great. It's really great. I love Instagram, but they took away like a lot of the creator features, if you will, as far as like being paid for your Reels which is majority of what I do. So it's, it's hard. It's hard because I love it, but I don't make the income that I wish I could, or I used to from there as far as like posting every day. So I really want to put my focus more on YouTube because, um, I want to get to 10 K this year. That's my goal. I'm going to hit 10 K this year. Um, that's just like what I want to do. I'm manifesting it, putting it out into the universe. So, uh, anyway, I want to dedicate more to YouTube and I want to like give you guys more. So anyway, going forward, I'm going to dedicate myself more to YouTube and Instagram. But like I was posting every day on Instagram and I wasn't seeing growth. And I even did this challenge this week where I posted every single day and I still didn't, I know it's like a, a coming up to a holiday weekend. So it's like hard balance and it's summer like I'm not really even on my phone that much I love YouTube I love long form comment content that's what I watch 24 7 I love watching like a show while I eat um I love just like listening to a podcast while I get my nails done like stuff like that so I feel like you guys probably love YouTube too I mean if you're here but with all that said I really want to dedicate more to YouTube so I'm gonna try and post still once a week but I just want to make it like fun and kind of like how I make my reels but um 
more in depth and like talking more. So I just feel like I haven't like talked a lot to you guys. So also, did I update you guys on everything with Easton? I cannot remember if I didn't. If I did, then I'll cut this part out. But if I didn't, then I'll tell you about it. So they told me that his weight is a little bit under. So they want me to bulk up his food intake. So feeding him three meals a day. Um, and then he comes back in six weeks for a weight check. And then um, he's still dairy, allergic to dairy because I tried to eat pizza and then the next day he had a major explosion in his diaper, which is so gross. Um, and yeah, but other than that, he's standing, crawling. He's not saying any words yet, which I'm like, boo hoo. I really want him to say mama or dada, literally anything. Um, and that's pretty much it on him. He's got eight teeth. He is really struggling at night right now. Um, and I'm struggling, but that's okay. That's pretty much the update on him. Me, I'm feeling good about myself-ish. Like, you know, obviously I'm not like perfect in my body, but I'm feeling good about myself for the most part. Um, but yeah, anyway, that's it. I'm gonna go grab us some coffee and then head home. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. I know it was all over the place. Next vlog, I promise I will be way more like talkative and consistent and hopefully have one day in the vlog. I mean, I like multiple days too watching, but I don't know, just I'm gonna, be more consistent i feel like it's been hard for me to pick up this camera because i've been picking up this camera and trying to do instagram so anyway i'm gonna try harder so stick with me help me get to 10k um but i love you guys and i will catch you guys in my next one bye guys